Hey guys, James here, and we're going to go through another Full Metal Monsters FMM uh, overview. This time we're going to look at the weapons of each dinosaur. This is for beta release. At the moment, we're currently on release 0.3. So everything you see here, of course, it's subject to change, you know, in later updates. But these are the way the weapons stand for the moment. Uh, just a quick idea of how you can get to these weapons. Obviously, you select your dinosaur and you just click on equipment. Now, how do you discern what is light and what is heavy so dinosaurs the way it works at the moment is uh, some dinosaurs can carry light weapons some dinosaurs can carry heavy weapons and some dinosaurs can carry both so in this case how do we know what's light and what's heavy pretty simple there's a little circle for all the light weapons and for all the heavy weapons well you can't see them here because obviously it's just a light weapon dinosaur but they will have the square if you want to get more info on the weapon you can click on this and it can go into more detail of what each weapon does so I'm just gonna quickly run through it now so that way you'll pretty much know what it is when you're playing so the very first one you come with which is standard and it's free is the rotary gun it's basically like a machine gun uh, straight tra uh, trajectory so pretty much it's just shooting constant bullets non-stop uh, you've got a magazine capacity of 60 and the range is 200 which is pretty good and uh, it's reload time is four seconds which is pretty good obviously I haven't upgraded anything yet I had to restart the account so just please forgive the level two or three at the moment don't worry I'll be up to level 10 by the end of today or should I say back to level 10 the next weapon is the rocket launcher this is the light rocket launcher as you can see it's also got a straight tra trajectory but this one's firing rockets so when it hits the target it's gonna explode does a little bit more damage has an area of damage as well which is pretty nice so that way you're not just affecting one dinosaur at longer reload time 12 seconds the range is actually a bit longer for this one which is cool but the capacity is quite low this one's actually really awesome in the beginning if you uh, equip the augmented allosaurus with him it can be quite potent well, let's go ahead and buy this we're gonna buy it anyway obviously uh, just to quickly equip or upgrade you can just click here and upgrade and to add it just follow the arrows you equip and it'll add it to the empty slots just click on which slot you want to equip and he'll do that now the revolver gun a little bit more heavier damage than the rotary gun only 26 in the capacity so you can imagine these are pretty big bullets also a straight trajectory very light weapon only affects the target you shoot a reload time of six seconds as well next up this is our precision rifle it's kind of like a sniper rifle look at that range 750 obviously uh, one bullet every 14 seconds so this is more for your brontosaurus you know your long distance sniper type of uh, creature next up these are the shock weapons so the tesla gun or well, when it fires it kind of looks like plasma but you know they've got the electrical sign here so it's energy uh, its range is also pretty high which is nice it gives off a cool blue effect when you fire it as well which is pretty awesome uh, reload time eight seconds it's a little bit high but you've got quite a nice capacity so it does a fairly decent amount of damage what's nice about these weapons are they uh, go um, through any shields pretty quickly so you're damaging dinosaurs with shields straight away so pretty effective the shell cannon is kind of like a shotgun uh, you get a capacity of nine the range is pretty short but it deals quite heavy damage close up so just kind of imagine it like a shotgun and you won't be disappointed this is the v rocket launcher uh, again the rocket can affect a small area it depends how much you upgrade it you know obviously the more you upgrade it the more powerful it will become um his range is pretty short though it's only 100 but you have more capacity so if you can get in closer you can deal quite a bit of damage with him he's pretty potent you only unlock him at level 7 though I mean you can see quite clearly here at what level you unlock everything so it's pretty straightforward next is the coil gun another energy weapon once again ev everything with blue is, from what I can see is it goes straight through energy shields so this is one mega plus of these immediately you can attack the metallic monsters they're going to be more vulnerable to these kinds of weapons uh, the range isn't that great on all of them you know obviously it'd be good to upgrade it but the capacity is amazing and the potential for close battle with these against metallic monsters is pretty effective the homing system now this one's really cool because you could be behind a wall and as long as you've um, locked onto your target he can just zoom in and find him and he has an area of damage as well obviously you need level 9 to unlock him come on that's easy right uh, capacity though you can only shoot uh, one round but then you have to wait 12 seconds so it's pretty potent pretty powerful uh, my recommendation is kind of mix this up on a brontosaurus like give him some of these uh, with his sniper as well so that way if you do get caught close up at least you can deal a bit of damage 
There we go. Now we're getting into a little bit more of the heavy duty of the light weapons. Um, this is an arching trajectory. What does that mean? So again, you can be behind some wall or uh, basically far away and just fire this and it will arch into the air and hit the enemy on the other side, going over obstacles. Again, very useful for long distance attacks. I mean, look at the range on this bad boy, 750. To be honest, this one's the perfect one for Brontosaur. Hit this with some sniper rifles. Yeah, you're going to do some damage. Very cool. The reload time though 25 seconds each time it's uh it's, it's a bit long but i mean come on it's gonna be worth it just if you upgrade this it'll be done to a pretty decent amount finally for the light weapons plasma rifle this is almost like a plasma sniper rifle the range here is 750 and like all the other plasmas it goes straight through the uh, energy shield and hits your target if he has an energy shield uh, 16 seconds and uh for every shot so it's it is the plasma sniper rifle so that's it for the light weapons overview thank you very much for watching subscribe if you want to see more videos like this and uh, keep playing. I'll see you on the battlefield.